Hello everybody, this is Pun Frugal Streamer, and I failed you miserably when I did my last voice meter tutorial. And I failed to tell you about the VA, VAIO's extensions that you can download to help you with routing your audio through Windows to voice meter. Remember those little blue little pointer things I was talking about on each of the input and output channels for your virtual buses and your input buses? Well, those are VAIO extensions. They do not come with potato or banana. You have to buy them separately and install them. What I'm going to do now is I'm going to actually fill you in on how to get them so that then you can then follow my other videos that I've done with Voice Meter Potato here lately. First of all, let's go to the website. All right, so the website is the web shop at vbaudio.com. All right, so you'll go to the web shop and then you'll look for MISC. And under miscellaneous, you will find two sets of VAIO extensions. The first one for potato, you got to make sure you get the right ones. The first one comes with standard and banana, and then the second one comes with potato. So if you're like me and you're using potato, you want to make sure you get these. So when you click on this, you can choose P1 as a fan for as little as five bucks, all the way up to P5, which would be $25. This is again, donateware, so you can donate what you wish. Add that to your cart and then purchase it. Make sure you also make an account because this is where you're gonna have all your response codes for your various voice meter softwares that you buy for your uh, own use. And you will have to come here occasionally and get the new code. So do all that. And when you purchase this, then you will get a response code that you can then enter in and you will install this. So once you install it, then you will have these little arrows that are at each of your channels for voice meter. And you can use these in lieu of VB audio cable. So I recommend instead of using the VB audio cables for this application, I would recommend using the VAIO's extension because it takes advantage of the Windows 10 and 11 audio routing. Now, if you're in an older version of Windows, like Windows 8, for instance, you have to use VB audio cable. This is for Windows 10 and Windows 11 users only. So what I'll do is I'll provide a link down in the description below that you can go directly to this page and you can download these if you do want to use these. I think they're a little bit more bang for the buck than VB audio cables, although essentially they perform the same function, but I just like that they take advantage of the Windows routing in 10 and 11, and they're updated to the new audio uh, formatting for Windows 10 and 11 too. So 64 bit, all the good stuff. So VB audio cables are not as far as I know. Okay, they're still using the old Windows audio formatting. So take advantage of them because they are really nice. I love using them for, you know, various things. Like if I want to patch all my music into the music extension that I've renamed, I can patch every single music app or browser or whatever into those extensions and send them all to one channel. And you don't ever have to worry about continually changing them around. They're all set and ready to go. If you got any questions about anything, let me know. It's pretty easy to install. You get the zip file, you unzip it, you click on the installer, follow the directions, and you're good to go. But anyway, if you do have any other questions, comment below, let me know, and I will try my best to help you out. You can also visit my Discord and go under support requests there, and you can ask for help there. And I will, I or one of the voice meter community members that hangs out on my uh, Discord, We'll help to answer your question. All right, everybody, thank you for watching. Have a great day. We'll see you later.